this is the Sagamore Bridge of the Cape Cod Canal, our third and last bridge that we are going under this morning. And we will soon be at the marina in about 20 minutes. Those puddles and this battery is almost dead. <laughs> oh no, really? <laughs> well, I'm not very good at making it a part of my daily chore to charge batteries on phones and stuff to get, and the trip, the trip is over, so. <laughs> yep, it's alright. You did good. You did well. So this should be a floating dock. We're gonna need fenders. And I'm gonna back in, I'm gonna be looking for that short little star line. Okay. But I am gonna call the marina and tell them that we're there. It's Monday, so hey look, the train. Yeah, so it's the train. That's why I'm coming over. The Cape Cod train. There. Yeah, I'll just push it up. It's not the train itself, it looks like some sort of maintenance. Yeah, tree tree work. Tree trimming operation. During the season, tourist season, they do scenic train rides from Hyannis into Sandwich and then along the canal. And then sometimes they do a dinner train and of course, the trash train. Trash train. You can also catch the train from Boston, the Cape Cod Flyer. And that comes um, down through from Boston into Hyannis as well. It's a great way to get tourists down on the Cape without having to fight the traffic. Pretty up and through there. At least on deck. Get away from this bird flag that's in every picture, in every shot. Oh, picture, sorry. Nice puppy. <laughs> the owner has them all situated just nice, sitting up pretty for a picture with the bridge behind him, her, it. <laughs> it's a great shot. It's a beautiful morning, beautiful coloring.
one day we'll be looking back at this video at these bridges and saying, remember when the yeah. Sagamore Bridge and the Bourne Bridge were there? Because I believe it's been passed recently to replace these bridges. Unless you have a boat, these three bridges are the only way to get off. The train bridge. <laughs> fill in the canal. And this. Oh yeah, a lot of people do say you should just fill in the canal. It doesn't need to be needed anymore. And the traffic, ship traffic can go around the tip of the cape. And it served its purpose. And now you just don't really need it. But I think it saves 136 nautical miles. That's quite a bit of fuel, especially if you're all paying four bucks to five bucks a gallon for fuel now. But our marina is just past that. Um, just moving the camera all around. Uh, just past that power plant right there. 